Shalom Israel. <coughs> Soccer. Shalom. I want to give all praises to the Heavenly Father, Abinawa Yahweh, by Shema Mashiach Yahweh Shah. Alright. Water to the Heavenly Father, for the Holy Spirit. And Shalom to all the brothers working out the righteous salvation, man. In the name of the Father and the Son. Shalom to all the Torah keepers, man. Much love. This video is going to be going into the elders, man. <clears throat> okay. I'm going to be going into the elders today, man. All right. Because it was the elders that killed Hamashak Yawashah. All right. So, chew on that, man. All right. You want something to eat on spiritually? You want to be edified? All right, you want to know uh, what spirit to be in? Not to trust man, man. All right? Because at the end of the day, all men, uh, you know, is a flesh, man, and blood, man. So we have to put our trust in something that is not a flesh and blood, man. So I'm going uh, to bring this out to show that the elders of Israel... They were the ones really that killed Hamashiach that was shy and was against them. So guess what? Today, the elders of Israel is going to be against the disciples of Hamashiach that was shy. So if you are Israelite and you've been, you know, rejected of the elders, that's a sign that you're, you're at Hamashiach that was shy. All right, this is Matthew chapter 15, verse 2. It says, why do thy disciples, right? I'll just read a couple of about the elders. Matthew 5 and 2. Why do thy disciples transgress the tradition of the elders? For they eat not their hands, they, they, for they wash not their hands when they eat bread, right? So, all the uh, Pharisees that followed uh, the elders, they said that the disciples of Mashiach didn't follow their traditions, man. And that's, that's a sign of... Uh, uh, elders being Pharisees when they get mad at brothers that's, that believe on Yahweh Shai but they get mad because they don't follow their traditions when they don't even follow their elders traditions so it's all hypocrisy at the end of the day you know what I'm saying nobody's following the tradition of their elders man fully brothers always uh, uh, you know what I'm saying be revealed different things alright things come more clearer you know, breakdowns, the most high reveal deeper knowledge. The scripture says uh, that wisdom and knowledge shall be revealed in the last days. All right. So, older men get mad when younger men don't teach what they teach, pretty much. Even in the world, your parents, you know, some Israelites might have parents that don't believe in the Israelite faith. And they get mad at Israelites that don't believe in uh, Christianity or Islam or whatever that they were or Jehovah Witness or whatever they was brought under under their family man so like we have to put our trust in the most high all right gotta put our trust in the most high and the son man all right and, uh, and keeping the commandments all right to hell with the traditions of the elders man the tradition of the elders is gonna get us destroyed man Alright, that's just what it is. The tradition of the elders, the Most High said we have to exceed their righteousness, man. Alright, the scribes and the Pharisees. Alright, the scribes and Pharisees were those of the elders, man. They were all following the elders, man. <clears throat> and they got mad at the disciples of Mashiach for not following their traditions. Alright, I'm going to go to uh, Matthew 16 and 21. From that time forth began Yahweh to show unto his disciples how that he must go unto Jerusalem. So Hamashiach was showing his disciples that he got to go to Jerusalem. And what's going to happen? And suffer many things, right? He's going to suffer, man. So those that are in Hamashiach, they're going to suffer many things out of elders, man. All right? So if you didn't got kicked out of the camps by elders or whatever, man, that's a clear sign you're in Hamashiach, Yahweh Shai. Right, because the elders, they they was against this, uh, Hamashiach Yahusha. They killed Hamashiach Yahusha. The elders, all right. And they tell you that they love the uh, preeminence, man, and receive if not the brethren. All right, so they don't receive those in Hamashiach Yahusha over uh, small 
you know, small differences, man, right? Because <clears throat> at the end of the day, it's about the faith of my Shaquille Rashad, man, and his testimony, right? And keeping the commandments and loving your brother like unto yourself, man. All right? It said that Yahweh Shah would suffer many things that are elders and chief priests, man. All right? So you're going to suffer from... You know what I'm saying? The elders, man, and the chief priests. They might make mockery of you, put your face on a video, whatever, man. All right? The so-called guys that's considered the uh, top top guys, right? Uh, the so-called clout Israelites, they call them. <laughs> and scribes. And be killed and be raised the third day. Again, the third day. So Hamashach Yahweh he was to suffer of the elders, man. And those in Yahweh Shai is going to be rejected and suffered of the elders, man. You know, elders speak ill of you, man. Don't even know you, man. That's what they did back then to Hamashiach Yahweh Matthew 12 and 23. And when he was coming to the temple, the chief priests and the elders, right, of the people came unto him and as he was teaching said, By what authority dost thou do these things? And who gave thee this authority? So they was they were saw that he was coming in an authority of his father, man. All right, and not under their traditions. Have Matthew uh, 26 and 3, right? Then assembled together the chief priests and the scribes and the elders of the people in the place of the high priest who was called Caiaphas. Well, I don't want that one. Uh, we have Matthew 26 and 47, and while he was yet, and while he yet spake, lo, Judas, one of the twelve came with him with a great multitude with swords and staves from the chief priests, man, and elders of the people, man. So that's the spirit of the chief priests and the elders, man. They want to kill their own people, man, like Judas, man, all right, who was one of the 12, man. All right, so these guys seem like they were in the Messiah, but they're not, man. He said they came against them with swords and staves, man, from the chief priests and elders, man, meaning whoever the elders deemed righteous or man of the Lord, man. All right? So it's all madness, man. All right? We better stop trusting in man and making man our flesh, man. All right? What is the curse be he that maketh uh, man his uh, trust, man? Maketh man his arm, man. You, you can't put your trust in a man, man. All right? You can put trust only in the Holy Spirit, bro. That's it. Now, if the Holy Spirit is uh, guiding you to uh, be led by a man of the Lord, then that's different. All right? But if you just trust in man and you don't uh, research nothing, he say, you see he going off and then you act like you don't see him going off, man. Nigga, you're a damn demon and you're going off, man. All right? Because, like, when you see your elder go off and you don't say nothing, man, the Lord see that. Don't act like the Lord don't see that, man, because the Lord see you a respecter of person. All right, so it don't matter how many views you get or whatever, how many brothers you get, all that is vain. If you uh, respect a person, they tell you that you be, you broke the whole law, man. James said that. All right, because guys that see their elders go off, and they they be scared to say anything, man. All right, they tell you if you got witnesses, you can rebuke the elder, man. The elder is not above rebuke, man. What is this some uh, Catholic doctrine where nobody can rebuke the uh, pope, man? In Israel, come on, man. All right, it tell you even in the law if a ruler or this people will go off, man. All right, it says, but against an elder, receive not an accusation, but for two or three witnesses, man. All right, and guess what? The witness of God is greater than man, man. All right, so I have my witnesses. My witnesses, me and Yahweh by Shem Mashiach All right, they know that that's what's going on, man. All right. And there's many brothers that witnessed and bear witness to this and have spoken on this. All right. But it's different Israelites putting their trust in different camps, man. And I had that spirit, man. All right. Because uh, you got to get in the spirit of Hamashiach Yahushua, man. All right. Like the brother Paul, man. It tell you, Yahushua tell you if you abide in him, man. Him and his father will make their bold in you, man. And they'll feed you with this word, man. But a lot of guys don't, it's not able to receive that because they they don't abide in the Mashiach Yahweh Shai. All right? They're not saints of Yahweh Shai. 
all right? There are damn demons, right, that just call on your house shot, right? Which we all have demons on us, but some brothers just, just willfully being demons, man. And some of us, we fall short to demons, man, all right? But at the end of the day, we we overcome through Hamashiach Yahweh All right? Because uh, the scriptures tell you, man, to pray uh, that you be not tempted, man. All right? Because the, the uh, devil can come with some terrible temptations that he know that you love. And, and, and it's totally root you out the truth, man. All right? Which, uh, you know, did, did Satan come against me like that, man? And... Almost get me up out of this thing, man. But by the grace and mercy of the Most High, I'm still standing, baby. All right? The water you howl. All right? So the hell with uh, being favored by man, man. All right? What it says, who's uh, praises of man and not of God, but they love the uh, praise of man more than the praise of God. All right? What is that? Getting a praise of your elders. Getting a pat on the back from your elder. Thank you, elder. Right? Which, uh, you know, some of these elders have good intentions, but there's uh, some elders that have, you know what I'm saying, corrupt intentions, man. And this thing is not about truth. It's a hustle, man. All right? And these elders, they're, they're murderers, man. Hamashiach Yahushua. You got elders that will wish death on other Israelites that believe on Hamashiach Yahushua. All right? You're crazy. When did Hamashiach Yahushua ever wish death on the sick and the blind, man? He had mercy on them, man. He healed them, man. And guys wish death on brothers in the faith, man. That's ridiculous. And these are elders that do this, by the way. All right? So I'm going to get a... Uh, See what I'm gonna get.